Now we got the tub in the bathroom, and it's time to start talking about the toilet or the WC. So let's take a look over here. Um, what our required clearances are. The IRC, or International Residential Code of 2006, that's pretty much what we're going by now, um, requires a 1 foot 9 or 21 inch clear zone in front of the toilet to the next wall or to the next item, and 15 inches that it fits in. So 15 inches to the center, 15 inches to there, so that's a total of 30 inches. It's recommended that you have 2 foot minimum front of, and you have an 18 inch opening there, an 18 inch there, which makes it a 3 foot, this is 30 inches, this is 3 foot, and if you're inside of a whole closet, like a little um, toilet room in there, you have a door on it, still have that, have that 2 foot, and then it's 1 foot 9 on each side. So that's 3.6. So we're going to, we have a lavatory or a sink there. This one here has walls on each side. So we're going to try for the one foot or three foot. And then we're going to move into the 15 inch if we need to. So 18 inch or 15 inch if we need to. So how we're going to do that? is we're going to take the tape measure tool. We've got our tub in there. I'm going to click this edge. My picture is giving me a little bit of a problem, so I'm going to just turn, because I can't see this bottom edge of this tub, and I want to be able to see the bottom edge of the tub, so I'm going to turn the image off for right now. Click that, and go 30 inches. or go 36 inches. So my vanity has to land, I'm gonna to try to land my vanity here, but it has to land here. So let's put the uh, toilet in. We're gonna start it out at 18 inches. And we go 18, because that's halfway of the 36. And I'm going to go one inch from this back wall. So right there is the center of the back of my toilet. So let's jump over here. Let's go to the 3D warehouse and we're going to search for a toilet. This one looks like a pretty good toilet. Um, any of these are going to work really. You want to try to avoid the ones that have a wall and everything. But I'm going to grab that one. I place it there. Now comes a little bit of a trick. I'm going to take this corner right here. And place it on this wall. I'm against the wall. I'm going to move that on the red axis one inch. So I'm going to move it out by one. Now it's one inch off there. I'm going to grab this, drag it straight down until it touches the floor. So I'm going to tap the up arrow key and then I can just touch it to the floor. Then I can move it to the center for 18 inches. So now I have that one inch off the wall, and in the on the center line. The other thing I could have done is grab this bottom button right here, clicked right there at the intersection. That would have got my one inch off the wall, and then slid this from the midpoint. The green axis, boom, got a toilet in place. And that's how we set the toilet. So we started out by putting a 30 and a 36 inch line, set the 18 inch line. We're going to try to give ourselves as much room as possible, and we're going to see what that vanity layout looks like. And we are done with putting in a toilet.